recently I had an MRI of my prostate because I've been on active surveillance for 15 years and they found no progression after 15 years, no progression. I think that's pretty remarkable. But do you have full confidence in that? Because I've had people that have asked me, do you really believe that? Do you, do you trust that? What would you say to that, to those people that are listening? Do I have full confidence in? In, in, the, te- in the technology when, because I, I trust my doctors. I did ask, well, should I have a biopsy just to make sure? And they said, you can, but we don't show any progression. What would your thoughts, I mean, as a urologist, would you say it's just best just to have the biopsy just, just to be sure? Or would you well, say trust the technology? Bit, yes. This is a little bit of a controversial area. And I can tell you that depending on which practice you, you follow with, you may get different answers. In yep. general, if the MRI is negative, the chances that you're harboring a clinically significant prostate cancer, one that may spread, one that may shorten your life, is in the 10 to 15 percent range. And so if you were to have an MRI in Europe and that was negative, you would likely not get a biopsy. We like to incorporate additional information in that, like what is your PSA density, which is a ratio of your sure. PSA to your prostate size. What did your initial biopsy show? How many of the biopsy cores were positive? How many were taken in total? And so it would be shared decision making. But in yeah. my practice, I do still periodically biopsy patients on active surveillance who have a negative MRI. 